time to have stage manager talk. Guys, I'm tired. You guys are tired. You're here earlier. I'm wearing these to protect my, my eyes. I'm getting homemade, filtered coffee by Tell Everyone Who You Are. Uh, Michael Damu, Upstate Manhattan Roasters. We're having some Haitian coffee today. It's good. It's like the cooking show where you're like, it goes in the oven. Okay, so what's the next step? What are we doing? Oh, we take my mug. We go pour over. <sighs> now people want to see. I asked people, oh my goodness. I asked people what they want to see and they said, I want to see backstage stuff. I want to see what we really do to get ready. Well, this is one of this the things. This is what it takes to get ready. Yeah, but not everyone has a cool person like you. And not everyone this. gets the cool coffee like That's you. Right. I pay them. <laughs> See what my mug says? Actually, I can. That's how I get through a five show week. How long do I let this sit? We're gonna let this steep for about two minutes. And then? And then the coffee will get you ready to go. And my voice teacher would be like, you really should be drinking tea. To that I say, Pasha! Sweet greens! It has arrived. They just said, you done with the takeover? No, nah, she said eight weeks. That's a long time. It is a long time. Ladies and gentlemen, you have to understand uh, what this woman goes through. She is, she's not just the leading lady of our show. She is, she's the foundation. She's what keeps us all together. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the woman who keeps all of these nutcases in the same place. And, and, and she's humble and, 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 she, and she's beautiful. She's intelligent and she has the patience of Job because there's so much Ridiculous testosterone walking around here, so you guys need to be there for Crimson. Hashtag be there for Crimson. Hashtag be there for Crimson. That was like the be there for Crimson. That was like the best dating. That should be like if I had a Tinder. That should be on my Tinder page. Date me. I'm a good person. And now we're back to Coffee Edition with Michael. How's it doing? Is it's, it done? No, it's still. It's still, still taking its time. Slowly getting all the flavors that you want to get through this fifth show. Because, let's be real. Coffee is five dollars now. That's it? That was, was it more? Yeah. Right. Where you go. That's true. Yeah, because if you get oat milk in it, watch out! Watch out! Watch out! Do you want some oat milk in here? I sure do. What am I wearing? I look like I, I am a hungover librarian. Michael, I am so excited to eat sweet green and a coffee. The bathroom might explode. <laughs> Oops. Oh, Cut that out. Oh, <laughs> always working out bits. Okay, Andrew, I'm coming. I know you have to focus. Woo! Yeah, honey. Okay, so you're putting on your makeup. We're gonna, you know, do just a little bit at a time. Gotta go back downstairs and run a couple of things. And then at the end of the show, uh -huh. we will all point to you <laughs> and be like, she went on for the first time. She not, did her, it. not your Broadway debut, because your Broadway debut is in Aladdin. Yes, but it was only a couple months ago, so I still feel very new to Broadway. And how long have you been in New York? I moved back here after tour in May of this year. And you were on the Pretty Woman tour? Yes, the Pretty right. Woman tour for a year and a half. Wow. Yeah. All right, well, I'm going to go let you get ready, and I will catch you when you're all dressed in your wig and everything. In the whole moment. I'm so excited. We love Anju. Anju's, like, just so on it and the best to work with, and you're just going to kill it today. Hey! <gasps> oh, hi, baby! Come on. Go see her. Oh, boy, look at your little hat. Look at your little hat. There's nothing in there. I need to get you treats. They're French braiding. They're a little. They're, it doesn't matter. It's okay. They're sisters today. They Don't look at my roots, roots. Broadway.com. Yeah. Are you excited? Yeah. yeah. You're ready. You had your you had your review of yep. your notes. Have the review. Your lip call. Yep. Beat my face. You know. Beat your face. You're it's ready to go. Sheena's little piggy. Yours will be ready the next time you go on. No worries. <laughs> Congrats! Thank Mount you. Mount Washington's favorite girl. <laughs> Mount Washington's Making her debut young. in Spamalot today. Yeah. So excited. Maria, are you like a backup dancer? What is happening? 
Janet. Oh my god, you guys look like you're. <laughs> These are hot. I'm just bringing her hair. No, you're hot. You're hot. Excuse me. Hello. Hi, you. Just come. Yay! Did you get through everything okay? Yeah. You feel good? I did. Maria, look, you pushed me over a little bit. Oh, no. <laughs> right. did you, Maria, did you shove with love? I, I guess I pushed. No. No, no. <laughs> Maria literally went. I think she we were just like, went. <laughs> this way. This way. Swing love. Swing. It's great. Swing shove with love. One more act to go. One, One more, more act. act to go. One more act. Camelot. So you got through Camelot. Camelot was the one you were worried about, right? I'm worried about Broadway. Okay, so you're not done it's yet. It's not done yet. But I made it through France. That's really Yeah! Exciting. Yay! Okay, so every week, at the end of the week, Russ gets dressed. He's the best dressed person in this building, so we're going to feature his outfit. So this is dressing with Russ. Russ, tell us who you are and explain to us what you're wearing this week. Hey Broadway.com, this is Russ Romano coming to you from the St. James here at the G. Jamson stage door. Uh, every last show of the week, this week it's Sunday, I dress up to celebrate the end of the week and so this is what I'm wearing. Uh, slacks are Joseph Abood uh, mm. for a Men's Warehouse. Boots are from uh, 1,000 miles from Wolverine. Socks. Socks. Gorgeous. Amazon. <laughs> Turtleneck from Amazon, this great coat I got at a thrift store in Chicago for $10. Wow. Okay, tell us Pocket about Square is from Fine and Dandy here in New York City. Yes. And this lapel pin is from a stoop sale from one of my favorite drag queens, Vodka Stinger. <gasps> Vodka Stinger! <laughs> yep. Oh so that's God. what Russ is wearing this week. This is what Russ is wearing this week. Do a spin. Yes! Yay! Oh my god! Yay! You did it! You did it! Hey, so how do you feel? I feel good! I definitely blacked out a couple times. When? <laughs> no, the whole show. <laughs> so what would you say mm -hmm. if someone was a swing, yes. they're learning how to do it, like what's the most important thing about being a good swing? Just relinquishing control mm -hmm. and being okay with not being perfect. Here we go. Yeah, I think that's the big one. Well, you were pretty damn perfect. Congratulations. <laughs> Thank you. talk. I'm tired. My voice is fine. My voice is fine. But a lot of you have been asking, I've been putting on social media, like, what do you want to see? Part of you uh, out there wanted to see a warm-up. Um, so this is a warm-up I'm doing with Joan Later, who's my teacher. All of this is a little tight today. So something that I'll do is just sort of stretch, like, all of this. All of this is super tight. It gets super tight during the week. Uh, I don't love pulling on my face, but all of this stuff gets super tight. My alignment, making sure that the vertebrae are aligned in my neck. And really taking a moment to just check in where, where, where I'm at. This is part of the technical part of what it's like to do eight shows a week taking care of ourselves, knowing when to say no, knowing when to say yes. Even when saying no to visiting friends or talking after the show, or maybe some people go, why didn't she sign after the show? Well, this is why, because we are tired and my job is to show up for those people. And there is a lot of anxiety, right? Like you're like, what kind of, uh? I have tons of water, I have throat lozenges, I got makeup, I got lashes, and I have an amazing show to do tonight. So I'm gonna continue warming up, and then I'm just gonna zone in and remember one thing at a time. So let's finish warming up. Meow, meow. 
It's kind of like ballet bar. You know, in order to do the crazy stuff, so you, you need the basics. Mio, mio, mio. Ni Sometimes warming up less is better. Your voice, it's temperamental, depending on what kind of voice you have. Because what happens is that you can over warm up, right? Sometimes you just have to let it be. It's like a baby, you gotta like slowly wake it up. Can't just rattle it awake. Think, 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 think. Merrily, 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 merrily. Life is but a dream. I have to go on stage very soon. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Oh God, I'm late. Shit. Ah, I'm late. Ah. This is, what is, should I open this? Yeah. Yes, we're opening it. Okay. Help me. Oh, All right, Max, we're Max. We're Max. <laughs> Thank you, Terry. Open it. Wait. Uh, open it. What is, Woo! what is, 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 Oh, what that is? It's the cowl. This is from that from the 1989. Are you serious? From the 1989. Tear it. Look at the symbol. Tear it. Oh. Can you wear that? Or that's no, just a display. Yeah. There we go. Wow. Oh, it has a stand. Oh no, it has. A it does have a stand. It has a Gotham City what? stand. What? Yeah, baby. Oh, oh my God. Oh. What I want. Oh, this is so crazy, man. You're one of the best. Happy birthday. Thank you. Thank you. I love you guys. I love, love you. Guys, love you. Love you. Love you. Love you. Love you. So, this is the quick change of the week and featuring one of our very own dressers who I love very much, Ashley Tim. Hi. So I dress the female ensemble as well as the lovely Jimmy Smagula, who we Yay. all love. Uh, I also happen to be an internal dressing swing. So that means I, in addition to my track, I also learn other dressers tracks in the building and anytime they need to be out, I will then cover them. Talk, to, talk us through exactly what we're gonna see today, what part of the show this is and what people are gonna sort of watch. Yeah, so it's towards the beginning of act two. We are coming out of the Knights of Knee scene and we're going into uh, the scene of a song called You Can't Succeed on Broadway. And so the girls are changing out of these kind of big, furry, ridiculous Knights of Knee costumes <laughs> into these beautiful white castle dresses. Um, and we're, there's eight of us in a very small space. That's right taking off giant costumes and then getting into these lovely gowns. Um, and so you'll see, it's a it's a little bit of a silly <laughs> choreography moment, but it's fun. That's so good. They're all ready. Look at them getting ready. Yeah. Everyone's ready. Are you guys ready for the amazing quick change? Here we go, here we go, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here they come. Okay, so they're... Oh, are we recording? Yeah. <laughs> Look at this. Look at this. Look at this technique. <laughs> Look at this. Everyone puts on their shoes. You have to do the tongue out. What's the tongue out? Oh. Oh. Interesting. Okay. Then the white dresses come on. I'm gonna show you. Uh -huh. Ready? There it is, head to toe, and you're all ready. All ready. All did it. Gorgeous. There you go. Yeah. You guys are amazing. 
Amazing, look. You wanted a quick change? You got it. Were you funny tonight? I did a good job, I did a good job. Um, yeah, I think I was, yes. That's a no. I'm more impressed by James knowing the Animaniacs theme song as well as I did. I've stumped him a couple, I've stumped him. And it's always fun when I don't stump him, but when I also, do, when he doesn't know what's coming. And tonight he really landed that. You look really sexy. <laughs> okay, we're gonna show you one more thing. At the end of the Lancelot number, the girls come off stage with their feathers and they have to all throw these feathers off and they have to be flown. The feathers are flown up to be stored up. So I'm going to show you that, which is very, very cool. Just a small little thing that I thought you might like. Seth, how many Jews have they I don't know a single Jewish person. And how is the good of a Broadway show? Broadway is thousands of years into the future. In a country that hasn't yet been discovered. So let me get this straight. I woke up this morning with a cold. Which is, by the way, if you hear that chirping in the background, that's my parrot. Yes, I have a parrot. So I woke up with a cold which is not ideal or fun right now, considering that uh, I have a show tonight. Tomorrow morning I'll be up at four-ish to get ready to be on the Today Show because Spamalot is performing two numbers on the Today Show. And for that, we sing live. So the first thing I did was drink a lot of water, um, called in an antibiotic because I knew immediately from my symptoms that I have a sinus infection. But for now, I have a voice lesson. We kind of warm up, see where my body's at, take a hot shower, steam, and we can get through it. It's 4.15 in the morning. I'm awake. And I'm still moving into my apartment. All right, so what are we doing? There's coffee. And our mighty, mighty friend, the steamer. <clears throat> I was supposed to call Jimmy and I was just about to call him and he said, I'm awake, I'm awake. I hope you are too. I was just calling you. Okay, it's 5.01. I'm walking out of my building feeling crazy. Wow. Howie.com, I need a filter. I need a serious filter on this face. Well, well, well. Escalator. Look how thin this is. Baby's on Ozempic. This is the official escalator of Ozempic. Here we are. Yes, of course. Here we are. Morning. Yee! Wow, look at this industry. This is what it's like out here. <gasps> it's the tree. Here. So, this is how it all happens. How are you oh. feeling? Hey, it's feeling like 5 a.m., you know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, whoa, whoa. Slow walk away, baby. Uh, 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 uh. Always look on the right side of life. Always look on the right Here. Look at the tree! We're here doing our like spacing rehearsal. So it's happening. So I'm about to come on this camera here and I'll go over there in a couple hours or this will be full of people. We're getting the face beat with Kat. We'll show you the beginning and then the end. And voila. Voila. So we still have to wear a microphone down the back because we're singing live today. Okay, we're so cold, but Jamie's, oh my God, look, here we are, here we are, here we are, here we are. Oh my God. 
look at the tree. <laughs> Thank you, Jamie, for keeping me warm. <laughs> All right, no. we just did a rehearsal. Now, we're doing the live taping. Here we go, here we go, here we go. She's a night. She's your night. We're a night. We're all night. Yeah. We did it. We made it back. <laughs> Woo, end of a long week. We did the Today Show. So many exciting things. Yeah.